Good afternoon, this is Jeff with Sewer Tech Northwest. Today we're at property address 803 Dove Avenue Northeast here in Salem. We're located on the right side of the home, on the backyard side of the fence. We have a four inch PVC clean out as our point of access. I'm gonna insert the camera and check the overall condition and serviceability of the sanitary sewer line. We'll have water running here in just a moment. I'll we'll zero out the camera counter right here at the base of the clean out. And it looks like it's transitioning over to 3034 PVC pipe immediately upon access. And it appears to be making a diameter change. It looks like it's kind of an unusual spot to transition to six inch pipe. But it looks like it's getting bigger here. So it does appear to be, it's, we're going to call it six inch. Anyway, here we go. It's kind of a long line here. It's going to go from the right side of the property all the way over to the left. It ends up going out into the driveway area. So I'm going to keep the camera moving fairly quickly here, but we'll, we'll uh, reel back in slower. A little bit of standing water there, nothing too crazy. When it comes to standing water issues, I typically won't... What was there was barely even worth noting, but typically don't get concerned about standing water until you have at least five feet of pipe with at least an inch of standing water. That's where I typically start to see toilet paper collecting lines. There's our water catching up. tie in there at the top there. That's the secondary clean out. Or I'm sorry, maybe that, that's it right there. Not, this might have a couple of them. lateral connection at 96 feet out. I'm going to do locates just to verify where this is at exactly and then we'll uh, let the line completely drain out here for a moment before reeling back in. So far though everything is looking good. I located the camera head successfully out the main on Dove Avenue. Again just so you kind of understand how the line's configured here it comes out of the right side of the home it crosses all the way over to the far left side of the property and there is a big steel plate in the driveway. That is the secondary clean out. So it kind of gives you an idea of how that thing is configured there. The whole thing has been updated though, which is great. This is not a, not a pipe material that would have been used with this age of home. It has had an update done to it at some point. That right there, one of these two tie-ins here is that plate in the driveway area, the secondary clean-out. That's probably likely the, the, that one we just went past about one second ago. The other one's going to be a test tee.
Now this is the only thing here I can even nitpick in the line, and it's nothing I would recommend repairing. There's a teeny tiny bit of standing water right here, but unless you're flushing diapers and pairs of socks down the line, that water there is not going to cause you any problems. We're just about to reel the camera on out of the line here. I am going to reverse direction for a moment. Let's go back inside the house. Everything from the clean out, though, out to the main lateral connection is in good condition, has good flow, and is functioning properly at this time. Now, it looks like right here, it's really hard to see it because of the turn here. There is something, it looks like Y connecting in right here. If you look at on the left side of the screen, there, it looks like there's a Y connection coming into the line right here. But that's as good a view as we get of it. It's really hard to see it. But anyway, I'm not sure what that's for there. Uh, you may want to pull records and look into it. Given the age of the line here, I would assume that whatever is whatever that is has been something that's permitted. You know, it could be something like a party line or something weird like that, but it could be a lot of different things. pipe here and that's as far as I'm gonna be able to go there but the interior pipe we just scope there is in good shape draining properly now the sewer line in its entirety is functioning properly at this time